Hey everyone, John here with DroidLessons.com and for today's lesson I'm going to show you how you can monitor the battery usage on your Android smartphone. So first thing you want to do is make sure you're on your home screen and we're going to want to go into um, the app market. We're going to download an app called Quick Battery and with this application we'll be able to um, see the battery usage via some tools and also have a battery indicator uh, showing the battery percentage left on your device right on your home screen via a widget. So first thing we're going to want to do is go into the market. So click the market button on your phone. On mine it was right there on the home screen. Um, it's possible it might be on a different screen on your device or for some reason you don't have it on any of your home screens you could always click on your app drawer which on mine it's right there on the bottom it's a little circle with an arrow there that's my app drawer and from there it'll list all the apps I have on my phone and you can uh, search for the market right there there it is but mine is right on the home screen and for most people it'll probably be right on the home screen just a little market icon right there so you will want to click right there and now we're going to want to search for the quick battery app and um, the best way to search is you can click the little search button on the top right there. It looks like a little magnifying glass. That's the search icon. So if we click there, now we can type in what we're searching for. So here, I'm going to click quick. I'm going to type in quick battery. That's the name of the app we're looking for. So I'm going to click search here. And there it is. It's the first one that popped up right over here. I'm sorry, the second one that popped up uh, by Sergey. Um, it's free. So we're going to click right there, quick battery. And there you'll see it's rated four and a half stars. If you want to see some of the reviews, you can scroll down and read some of the reviews. Everybody pretty much loves this app because it works really well on all the devices. So. Uh, I'm going to click the free button there. That's the button to click it to install. Uh, I'm going to click OK on the permissions. And now the app is being downloaded. If I want to check the status of the app being uh, downloaded and installed, I can scroll down. I can click the top of my uh, notification bar. And there it tells me Quick Battery is successfully installed. Okay. So now um, I can click the home button on my device and now what I'm going to want to do is install a widget on my home screen so that I can see the battery icon and the battery usage right on my home screen and the way to uh, install a widget is on my home screen here you're going to want to find a blank area if you don't want, if you don't have one here um, you can delete an existing icon or you can go to another screen that has an empty space like this screen right here I have lots of empty spaces I can just click here and install it here. But I'm going to install it on my main home screen here because uh, I want to see it every time I turn on the phone. So I'm going to long press on, the, on a blank spot and long pressing is when you press your finger for more than three seconds on one spot. That's what they call a long press. So I'm going to long press on a blank spot here and then some options come up. Uh, the option that we're going to select is widget because quick battery is a widget. So I'm going to click widget and then scroll down until I see the widget quick battery. And there it is, quick battery. So I'm going to click that right there. And now some options appear for the widget. Um, the one we're concerned with right now is activity to launch. And this is what will be launched when you click the quick battery icon on your home screen. So we're going to click that, Activity to Launch. And then we're going to click Featured Activities there. And what we want to do is see the battery use. So we can click Preview here. And that's, that's where it's going to tell us what's uh, utilizing the battery the most. So I'm going to click Back. And that's the one we want, Battery Use. So I'm going to click Battery Use. There we go. 
and that's it. Now I'm going to click the done button on the bottom there. Done. And as you can see, it created a icon of a battery right on my home screen. And there it tells me there's 50% of my battery life left on my device. Um, that's much better than having to look at the little top battery icon there and try to guess how much of my battery is left. With this one, with this widget, I can just see a percentage, which is a lot more useful. Now, the added benefit of this widget is that it doesn't only just tell you the percentage of the battery left. If you actually click it, it'll launch that feature that we asked it to where it'll show you what exactly on your device is using the most battery. On mine, it'll tell me right there um, on the top that my phone has been unplugged for 3 hours and 19 minutes. And since that time, it'll tell me what has utilized the battery the most. And on mine, it's voice calls because I've made a lot of phone calls in the last 3 hours. And then cell standby, Wi-Fi, phone idle, Android system. These are all the things that have been using my battery the most in those three hours. If I want to delve deeper into some of these uh, categories to, to find out more information, I can click it. Like if I click voice calls, it'll tell me, you know, time on, how, 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 many, uh, how many minutes I've actually been using the phone for, uh, for voice calls. Another item I can click on here is Wi-Fi. If I click Wi-Fi, here it says 16% of my battery. So 16%. Wi-Fi has used 16% of my battery in the last three hours. Um, if I haven't used Wi-Fi at all today, that's a good indicator that I could, you know, I could turn off Wi-Fi and save 16% of my battery life. Um, you know, if I haven't used Wi-Fi at all today, that's a lesson learned right there. I could have turned it off. Um, and here it gives me the option. I can click Wi-Fi settings button right there. I can click that. Oops. I can click that right there. And here I can turn off Wi-Fi. I can just uncheck Wi-Fi and disconnect. And then I'll know that I don't have to worry about that using my battery. Um, so it's, it's pretty, this is a pretty neat program. And we'll uh, hopefully enable you to save some battery life on your device so uh, that you can get the most out of your Android device here. Hopefully this lesson has been helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to uh, contact me via the comments or the contact page. And be sure to turn, tune in to droidlessons.com in the future. We'll have plenty of more uh, tutorials and lessons uh, to help you use your Android smartphone. Thanks for watching.